So J.D. has scored himself an epic win with the media, and specifically A.H.'s shill media, being forced to admit that the man he's on the comeback. You'll notice right there in the headline, they admit it. Now this win, and it is indeed a win, is not only trending, it is trending worldwide. You can see the hashtag right here under entertainment, hashtag JD Rises MT. <laughs> there are some salty, salty people in the AH camp too. It is beautiful stuff. You and I, we're going to talk about that today. Ah, oh, fun times, huh? Fun times indeed. All right, so hey there to all you fine folks on this fine day, by the way. I hope you are doing excellently. And outside of the win itself, my favorite part of this story is who ended up breaking it. Because this comes to you from the New York Post. Now, the New York Post was such a big A.H. shill during and immediately after the trial that you had A.H.'s PR team going to them for exclusives. They are now admitting that J.D. is on the comeback. They're admitting it. They're covering it because they know A.H. is on the outs. With them telling you about J.D.'s rumored MTV Video Music Awards appearance, confirmed. That's right. Confirmed according to them. Now, what makes this even better is that A.H.'s other go-to shill network, that would be TMZ, they're the ones who reported the potential for this happening happening. They talked about the growing buzz before the story broke with them headlining JD MTV's calling surprise gig in the works. So even they're getting on board because they know which way this train is heading. Yeah, it's looking like those PR checks must not be going through to places like TMZ because they not only broke news about this win, again, with them calling this a comeback. That's what every place out there has been saying. He is on the Hollywood comeback, but they broke other news. News where JD, he had gotten his multi-year seven-figure extension with Dior, them admitting that he makes bank for them too, and that he was going to continue being the face of the Sauvage fragrance line. I mean, that that says plenty about where the hype train for AH is and how that thing, it seems to have derailed. Now, a lot of other places are picking up on this too, but what makes these prior AH shields so interesting is the way that they're reporting on things. Why? Because it tells you they believe the man he's on the upswing. He's making that comeback. I mean, just think about this. A few weeks ago, they were trying to burn his career down. Anytime he picked up a role, they would try to take it out. Now they're reporting this stuff matter of fact. I mean, sure, they're going to bring up the case, but look at what they have to say about his comeback. They don't have anything negative to add. Quote, J.D. will make good on rumors that he is making a special quote-unquote comeback appearance at the 2022 MTV Video Music Awards. Again, everyone adopting that language to come back. I mean, that is a positive word. Not only does it say career on the upswing, but it says we agree that that, that's going to take place. A source close to the production. Now, for them to track down sources for JD positive material, too, that says a lot as well. Why? Because that tells you they know that AH positive articles, they are not selling. JD positive articles, they are. So, they want to catch as many as they can. So, a source close to the production has confirmed to the Post that the 59-year-old star will dress up as a real-life moon person, the silver astronaut statue that the Video Music Award winners are awarded. Now, you know how those shows go, too. So, for JD to play a part like that, for him to dress up as one of the moon people there, that says that he plays some type of prominent role. That, That says something about Hollywood and how the media, they view him as well. Now, Jack Sparrow's team declined to comment when the Post reached out, but 
Our insider said the actor is indeed locked in to appear via video, and they also know their other... (laughs) Now, another thing about this that the media is also admitting is that Hollywood, the people making it up anyhow, aren't the people that have problems with JD. It was companies and specific people that backed AH, people that had some type of agenda that went after his career. But when you look at the names that will be performing along with him, I mean, look at this. You have so many names, high profile ones. Nobody is threatening to walk away. Everyone saw exactly how this trial played out. This is making AH and the people around her Very, very mad, too. Why? Because they're trying to push and pressure stars. And, well, it looks like that's failing. Now, forget Hollywood or shill media for just a second. What really, really makes AH and the people around her mad about this, specifically her PR team. Her PR team, they're trying to plant stories here and there. You can look them up and see what else is coming up with this story. But... They can't stop this story. Why? Because the public picked it up. And not only did they pick it up, they ended up embracing it. They embraced it so much, in fact, that you have, like I was saying, trending tags. And these trending tags, they are trending worldwide. People are talking about the man's comeback. They're talking about how much success he has. And it's not just in the Video Music Awards under this. If you look at some of these posts here, This post, for example, JD just reached 27.5 million followers on Instagram. We're talking about an account with 30 posts on it, having 27.5 million followers. The growth on this, I mean, it has been utterly insane. And that tells you, and the media, I think, is noticing this too, the public, by and large, they back this man overwhelmingly. I mean, if you look, like I said, at people and their comments here, they do want the man to have a career. They do not want people like A.H. to be able to silence that and take that away. And it's amazing. Like I said, we have never ever seen anything like it. I thought that this was fascinating, though. Again, keep going through the tacking here. You'll notice epic win. Somebody that was canceled just a few years ago is now on the comeback trail. Movies, appearances, and so much more. But anyway, let me know what you think about this. And as always, I appreciate the heck out of you. You make this stuff work. Thank you. I can't say that enough. Want to help the channel out, by the way. Links are in the description. Check those out. They definitely help us out. But you being here, that is the biggest help of all. Thank you. Appreciate you. Share this everywhere, too. And I'm going to end here. Thank you again, and we will see you soon.